What's up, everybody? Welcome to the stream. My name is Castius, joined by the lovely Catsco, as always. Um, it's Friday. Welcome to the Imperium show. That's something I've never said before. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it rhymes. It must be true, right? That's how it works. It rhymes. Way to go. <laughs> we got to get in the game. We got a fishing derby to run. I know. Such issues. Ah, uh, well, good news is that I fixed the patcher. You can get the file um, from the Discord or the forum. I uploaded a new client entirely. Version one point nine is out, so that's pretty cool. And I actually found out you can just delete what's in the in the middle of the the base directory in that That's JSON cool. file and run the patcher and it's good to go. So there you go, pro tip. Please place that on my desk beside you. Oh, how much we got? Yeah, two minutes seems accurate. Hmm? A beverage? Man, we're cutting it close today, that's for sure. Yep. I didn't even shout that I was streaming or anything. I don't even have the... have anything going on. Where's the Discord? Hey, hey! It's Neville. <laughs> it's Scott. How's it going, guys? Happy Friday. You want to be a Scott, don't you? Happy Friday, indeed. Oh, look, we already have a complete raid going on. This is pretty sick. That's how I troll. <laughs> this is the best Friday ever. Holy fuck! <laughs> Let's go. Oops. Going. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. So what was the update to the client? Like, is there any changes that we need to know about? or? Nah. I He just updated the patcher in it. And, you know, every once in a while, he just updates all of the spell files and whatnot. So yeah, it's are... just current, so it's easier for new players. Gotcha. And they won't have to download that file or anything like that. So anybody just getting the patcher would already have the updated stuff. Then. Right. Um, hold on one sec here. Oh yeah, the raid is bumping already. I don't have to do anything. Yeah. I can be extra lazy now. All right. Speaking of which, I think guys, probably almost everybody except for anybody that's really late. So I'm gonna toss it over to you, big man. Did he just call you fat? I think so. I'm okay with it though. <laughs> <laughs> so you already claimed you were lazy, so fat just goes with it, right? Wait, what did I miss? <laughs> oh, hilarious. Jolly called you Jolly. <laughs> ho, ho, ho. I'm a little confused. It says, drop this file into your client and overwrite the old one. Right. Yeah. So when you put it into your client, it, it should overwrite the old one. The you just be in the client folder, right? Yes. Yeah, just the... drop it into your client folder, and okay, then you should get the pop-up. That text. Okay, gotcha. That's if you don't get the pop-up, you didn't have it. Got it. 
That, as like as it turns out, though, that, that would also work. work. Yeah, it would just fall right in. <laughs> and you probably got to uh, adjust the path name anyway, unless you have the one that he has there. You can actually... Um... You can actually just delete the path in between the, the, the base directory URL, basically. Just delete it and, and leave that empty between the quotes, right? You know what I'm saying? It locked me out. It wouldn't let me log in. It, it's actually better that way. I was wrong about the other one. Hold on. Me... Print it in Discord so it makes more sense than me saying it out loud. What's up, party people? What's up? What's up? What's up? <laughs> okay, so actually, just like that, without the... Sorry, I put that in game questions. I'll put it in, I'll put it in the raid. Although that doesn't really make sense because there's extra quotes around the whole thing. <laughs> You're confusing me. He's confusing yeah. me. No, I'm confused. That's a syntax error. It is. It really is. Here you go. There. That's what it should look like. No C, Imperium, Roth 2, whatever. You don't need that. That's what I'm saying. You just need to leave the quotes around that area. Right. Okay, here we go. Fishing! What? 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 Oops. I'll just turn off my UE. That'll be fine. Quick! Hug him! Yeah, I'm gonna get Lenice's money. Ah, I got him. Woo! <laughs> Who's in? And we're off and fishing. Woo! I got a good feeling. I'm going to catch the Whopper tonight. I got a feeling. Oh, you going to Burger King? I'd rather catch all that very personally. I just, I just want to catch the whole ocean, ocean again, like... Happen one night. <laughs> Look, let's be honest. I'll be happy not to catch an old shoe. Mm. <laughs> I think you're going to be very happy today. Yeah, yeah. I don't think that's possible. So, so can, can, can we start the new movement since you know, somebody caught the ocean one night, pounds on hashtag, decimal points matter? <laughs> <laughs> they really do. Mm-hmm. Mm. Not a baby. Turn my cam off here for a second. Gotta eat some pizza. Ah, uh, we are also eating pizza. Hmm. What I did have you choose for your topic? So... Well, I got you all beat. I had chicken fried bacon. You bastard. <laughs> wow, a, lo a lunker already. Wow. Almost 700 pounds. You know, the sad thing is, based on catch rates and stuff, that probably won't even place. Probably not. It feels good, though, doesn't it? Yeah, it feels good to get it, but, you know, yeah. I, I don't Sitting have here with, with my 3.5 pounder. Oh, I just got a 2.7 right after the 696. <laughs> yeah, getting the getting the rod is confirmation you did it right. <laughs> That's my favorite part. <laughs> <laughs> How did I know that was coming? Um. Okay, he's telling me that I don't have enough platinum to enter. Just take Just give him... out and hand it to him. Ah, okay. okay. Or it's just because he doesn't like you. That's possible. I mean... I think that's the right one. Okay. 
I've now entered the derby. Excellent. Time to, time to, time to bring out my inner hillbilly and whoop all y'all. Just break out that rod and start swinging it around. Yeah, just whip out that pole and, and you know, wiggle it around until something bites it. <laughs> like a historical movie had my wallet where we actually handed I.I.I. instead. <laughs> I keep hoping to put the buyer ability and I'll just set in the bazaar all day long in buyer mode. Sucking up all the eyes. Does yeah. that not work? That'll work. I don't know if it does or not. I've never tried it. I think it works. Um, does it work? Does it work here? I think so. I didn't think it did. I've never seen, seen a, an emu where it did work. Oh, really? Hmm. Maybe it doesn't, and I'm not sure. I've never actually tried it myself. <clears throat> I thought what? I thought people were using it though. Using what? Buyer mode. I could be wrong, but I think I used to set juice up to buy stuff that I didn't want to farm out myself. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, Durker's right. That's what I use it for. Right, right. It's the uh, it's the uh, it's the uh, Alec clone before we had the Alec clones. Right. Yeah, but you can still link them in game, so you can pull up the mm -hmm. can of whoop ass and shit like that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I had that on live. The can of whoop ass. <laughs> I don't remember what I did to get it, but I had one. It was the can of whoop ass. Oh, I guess the prosthetic I leg, hell yeah. Mm -hmm. That stupid boat scared all the fish. <clears throat> That's why I fish on another island. Why ain't you special about your show off? No, it was the first time I tried it, I was just seeing it didn't work. Hmm. Oh, yeah, you can, you can fish, fish anywhere in the zone. It's yeah. just, you know. <laughs> I like to fish while I'm standing beside him. You just like to try to steal his fish. Oh, I haven't even turned to fish in yet tonight. It's going to be one of those. <laughs> I just realized Cats was streaming. Yeah, I got it going for it. There we go. Up a little bit. No. Lots of bait left. I lost my pole. Ten point nine, sweet. <laughs> no, it is. Already got your follower goal a hundred percent. Oh, that's terrible. I should have reset that. <laughs> and goal. You know, Scar, I didn't don't know if you know this or not, but mm. when you're out mining for ore you can beg the ore ore piles for skill ups. You can what? Sorry? You know, the ore piles that you mine for, like, the Damascus ore and stuff? Yeah. You can use the baking skill on them for skill ops. Oh, that's hilarious. Mm -hmm. 
they actually will pay out in silver and occasionally a gold piece. So the, the betting coin is not related to what is actually on the mob? No, apparently not. No, the same with the pickpocket? No, pickpocket is based on what's on the mob. Baking, however, is an algorithm server side. Interesting. Hmm. Just begging for ore. <laughs> yeah, I was hoping if I begged, you know, since it let me, they'd say, here, take some Damascus, but no, 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 just here's some silver, go away. That's hilarious. Please, sir. Yeah, I'm up to like 160 something now in begging skill. Nice. No, you, you don't even have to mine the ore. You can just go to a pile of ore and sit there and beg. <laughs> this is the occasion where the joke went right over Wallet's head. I have to change the subtitles. That's a rare occasion. You should mark your calendars. Yeah, he's too fast. He would catch it. Dang it. I broke my pole. Sounds painful. It was. Yeah. Fortunately, I can just I buy a replacement. The modular. What are you talking about? I gave this guy a last name. Okay. That's that's pretty clever. <laughs> I had to. He needed a last name. And it uh, had to be that. So, Boo Boo is now choosing people's last names. <laughs> he didn't have one. <laughs> he didn't have one, so. Where are you posting that? Game pictures? Screenshots? Also, uh, step up on purchasing their time up. There you go. <laughs> well, a little more gentle, I ah, guess. That's awesome. Right? He totally needed that as a last name, right? You know, yeah, I, I gotta, gotta agree. agree. That's, that's a good, good one. one. <laughs> <laughs> well, I just got to upgrade my 696 to an 822. Sweet. I might actually place. You, you bastard, I hate you. Bottom three. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I mean, I, I turned, turned in a 300 and something, I know I'm not going to place, but at least I got something turned in. I got a 242. I don't even know. I forgot. 219.2 is mine. But that's okay. I'm kind of all right with not winning the fishing derby. <laughs> Me too. Me too. But, but I'm here to participate. Oh yeah, no, I'm here to play. <laughs> Do your damn rights. I'm gonna take the money <laughs> if I do place. <laughs> Did you post the five link poles? And... Holy shit. Sorry. Did you post the link? The link to what? The channel? Oh, the stream? No. No, I didn't. Because huh. I'm eating. What do you want from me? <laughs> this is why anybody watching them eat. Right? I turned off my cam just so people didn't have to. And we thank you for that. Okay, silly question. Uh, 
do you t do you actually catch fish that are like you know 700 pounds something or do you just catch fresh fish and turn them in like the actual fresh fish you catch the item itself is doesn't have a weight okay because all it's i'm catching is fresh fish, fish. okay and did you did you enter the tournament i did yes okay so you, you need to look for your the... fishing where it says yeah. what you're catching yeah it says uh, you caught a nice fish this fish weighs blah 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 oh yeah. no i just it just keeps saying you've uh uh, oh, oh yeah, yeah. okay. okay. So you, you caught, caught a fish as well. Nine point three. Okay, I see it. Okay, thank you. Okay, so nine point three is a flag, so it's not like you can set like a fish in one slot of your bag and then think, right. oh, that's a high level. You know, it's just a flag, and the next time you fish, it'll overrun. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. So make sure that you turn one in. To yep. get. Don't pull a tage. Okay, so actually turn in the fish that I. Okay. Just you can go up and talk to him. Go hell. Just go hell. Just follow his instructions. Yeah, make sure you don't fish again until you do that. Until you get a fish worth turning in. Okay. Oh my god, that's another pull. I got three casts out of that and it broke. It tells me I haven't caught a fish yet. What? Uh, okay, so you must be mooching. Fish yet. Well, I just gave you one. You you must have been mooching. You just, must be just mooching. Just catch another fish. Go catch another fish. Okay. Your nine pound fish is okay to lose. <laughs> I like my nine pound fish. Under the fish's weight, does it say uh, an opportunity to mooch has presented itself? Okay. Uh, I've caught an enormous fish. The mooching, your mooching bait has been used up. There you go. There go, go. Okay, go talk so to him. Go talk to him now. Okay. Do I hand this fish to him? You, you can. You can, but you don't have to. You can just hail him. Yep. You can give him the fish or just hail him. It works either way. Okay. So, okay. So 530 pounds. Uh, do you wish to submit this fish? Yes. Okay. Boom. There you go. It's that easy. Go. Sorry, I don't mean to talk with my mouth full. So that that's it? I mean, can I catch more and try yes. to catch a bigger fish? Yes, oh, okay. so if you catch a bigger okay. fish, then you can exchange it for that fish. Right. Okay. That one saves. Don't, no, don't exchange a smaller one, though. Yeah, that would be bad. <laughs> okay. The Voodoo God, thank you for that follow. Appreciate you. Because he will. He will exchange a smaller fish, but that can be hosed. Oh yeah, he's indiscriminate. And he doesn't give a shit. <laughs> You're telling him what you want to do. Gotcha. Oh, you want to turn that one pound fish over that nine hundred pound fish? All right. All right. That's what you want. <laughs> you said so. There you go. I just zoned out. Let's just go. The Voodoo God. Thanks for subscribing, man. I fucking zoned. I'm an idiot. <laughs> <laughs> I hit my lobby button. Lobby and fishing look somewhat similar, right? Absolutely. Right? Right? <laughs> They're spelled exactly identical if you're a winner. <laughs> That's a fair point. <clears throat> Woo, 35.8. So starting next week, I'm going to be trying to do, or well, I'm going to attempt doing some giveaways on the stream. So if you're in the Twitch chat. You'll be able to enter the draw. Ooh. <clears throat> Very nice. Yeah, but it won't be anything real. It's classy. It's like a shrubbery, right? 
Oh, I would never give away shrubberies. Are you insane? Those things are price priceless. In. Oh, two minutes. two minutes. Two minutes. Last chance. Fish, little clockwork fish. Bum bum bum. The webcam is back on. I finished eating. Yay! <laughs> hey, you get to suffer my ugly mug. Ha ha ha! <laughs> I have to look at a Canadian every morning on our stand up, so you know, it 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 can't be that bad. I don't see you. What are you talking about? Mm. Caught up? Not caught up, I guess. It crashed. Your phone crashed. Oh, maybe. <laughs> no, okay. Look at all these fishers. How many people we got here tonight? Oh, I don't know where I'm typing. Fifty-five. Respectable. Up here. It's over half the people on the server. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm calling it. There's no way I'll catch a fish and be able to get it in at this point. I definitely did not place. <laughs> yeah. hey, both. I'm pretty sure I got somewhere in the top ten. That'll be awesome. I'll be, I, I'll be happy if I'm in the bottom two. I'll say I'll be in the bottom ten. <laughs> oh, well. <clears throat> Full broke with one <laughs> second left. That's hilarious. <laughs> Valtar, grats on first, dude. What'd you get? 988.9. .9. That's a big ass fish. Well, well, congratulations, everyone. 573. I got six. <laughs> Jester, Eridia, Rain Dawn, Lenice, Into Juice, Ethor, and Taiwan. Or Taiwan. Taiwan? I know. <laughs> All right, what is it now? It's retail. Yeah. Seven thirteen first. Boom. No, no, we just go right there. Oh, we're gonna do ohm. Okay. Sure. Don't forget the boo boo. We need the fast fast. I know. We need to make an even better one of those just for fun for funsies <laughs> oh, so uh, I can't <laughs> I'm self sufficient Hooray! <laughs> little does he know <laughs> Ah, what the heck?
Oh, where am I? I'm standing in the middle of nowhere. Hello there. How'd we do here? First place was 18 million platinum, is that right? Yeah, 18.2. It's a good haul. <clears throat> Onitis. It's a good name for Necro. This one. Small piece of Imperium. Those are the gateway to the magic. That really is a cool animation. Animation? <laughs> did you did he get you? Kidney stone. <laughs> Dude, that's not even funny right now. I think I might be getting a kidney stone. Oh, I thought it was hilarious. Well, you would. <laughs> you know, I've discovered the actual use for those small pieces of Imperium because every single new player that joins the server asks the same question in OOC. So what the what they're used for is to make people ask questions in OOC. Oh, I see. <clears throat> they're, they're, it's, they're, it's it's like a filter you find out who does and doesn't need the forums. They're a participation inducer. Wait, hold on. I did something wrong. Uh, Wait, hold on. <laughs> Sorry, Arnok, I had to split you up. <laughs> okay. We're, uh, we're not on speaking terms anyhow, so just, you know, put her ass uh, elsewhere. <laughs> <laughs> Did I get everybody? Can, oh, four. Can Beast Mode get a invite to the raid? Sure, where are you at? He is, uh... Can he just do it the same way, even though he's not in the raid, through the Emar guy, Badass? Yep. And they get, okay. Just make make sure you join the army. Yeah, join his army. <laughs> Hope you don't mind your new last name. Who should he... Who should he hail to get an invite? Scar. Scar, Scar. okay. You gotta find Scar. Scar. I'm, I'm on the ramp. 
I'm the I'm the I'm lizard mummy in a dress. Hey Sky, you should probably change those R's to H's. <laughs> Dude, that would be epic. I can't. That that's not my name. It's just how it's pronounced. No, your name is clearly Scar, and you're <laughs> <gasps> oh, How dare you, madam? You wound me. <laughs> <laughs> I just thought you had thicker skin than that. <laughs> Legendary scab. <laughs> That's amazing. Uh Scar meeting <laughs> mages. Yeah, beast mode activate. That's the shit. Right? <laughs> that, the, that's a fantastic. The last name was so perfect. <laughs> that's the greatest name. I really hope you don't mind. Okay, I think we're ready here. I have to cast. Okay, do that. Excuse me. Maybe he doesn't even know that his last name is now activated. He didn't notice. <laughs> I did a few times now, and he hasn't complained. Self gate. All right. We still got to do this one night where you just go where he told you. You get split up from your groups and shit. Oh, you should get a bonus for doing that. For doing the right area. He popped her bottom. Bitch. Is it my buff bitch or are you calling me bitch? Hey. I'm thinking no, it's a little of column A and a little of column B. Where is the guard that we're supposed to hail? So the captain of the guard should be at the bottom he, of the oh, ramp. He's right at the he bottom of the ramp. Up. He was just covered up. All right. Everyone's everyone's yeah. currently hugging he him. He kind of gets dogpiled. Make sure that you get the, the blue text or whatever it is on your screen there. Not a ding if you've got sound. Nobody plays with sound. Look, I'm a, I'm a noob I didn't, I didn't get it for you. Oh. Oh. I'm a noob. Did you, did you join the army before you came? Yes. Did he tell you you were assigned to a gate? Receive a temporary flag? No, it says I have no business here. Was I, what was I supposed to do? I did it. I came through the bad ash thing. Oh, you got to go back and tell him join. Go tell him. You got to join the army. Yeah. Where, how do I do that? Go back to the hail guild bad lobby ash. and hail bad ash. And tell him join. Oh my goodness. <laughs> go quick. You got a couple minutes. <laughs> Wait, the Jensen. Well, you know, it's like, oh, you got a couple minutes. No, no, you don't. <laughs> yeah, hurry up. <laughs> Be fast. Yeah. Well, good thing both zones he's going to <laughs> are already loaded in memory, so they'll zone fast. Yeah. Oh, pets, that's a good idea. Everyone's hiding behind me. I'm I'm not a I'm not a tank. <laughs> oh, neither am I. Okay. Yeah. So I got in through Pat Ash and he gave me a gate and then he when I held him again he tells me I'm currently locked out. So I assume I'm good. Huh? I don't 
That was close. Yeah, don't forget to take the fishing poles off and put your weapons back on. Did you get an insignia that says P on rank? Uh, I already had one. I actually, okay. I'm, that's actually private, I think. Or, okay, you're good. Yeah, you're probably good. I'm a tiny clockwork private. So are we doing this on similar to Kip, where uh, Necro's running and grab a bunch, and I, I vaguely remember us doing this one a long time ago, but I don't remember it. <clears throat> so. Yeah, it's 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 similar. It's very similar, yes. Okay, sounds good. You just tell me when to go out and pull a big group, and I'll go out and pull a big group. So, waves of mobs will spawn on either side, the east side and the south side. Right. And the more trash we kill, the more names spawn. The more names spawn and we kill, the more points we get. Okay. If we let the named walk by and they get into the city, they will kill one of the Forsaken yeah, that are standing there. there. Sorry, they're the Chosen. I know them as the Forsaken. Anyways, um... <laughs> <laughs> if all 13 of them die it's game over we lost okay so here's the chosen here they're hanging out if all those guys die we lose and it's definitely happened before <laughs> babies come from well okay so it starts with a bird and a bee and i have no idea how any of that shit goes <laughs> what well the bird makes a few tweets and the bee buzzes <laughs> and then they hook up through instagram mm-hmm <laughs> First, you subscribe to her OnlyFans, and you pay her lots and lots and lots of money. And then one day out of the blue, she just magically reaches out to you. Hey, dude, you've given me a lot of money. You want to hook up? That's how it works. Yeah. <clears throat> and then you become a baby daddy. <laughs> and then she gets all your money after that. And then it's all over for you. If only I had an item that shrunk my pet and not my whole group. Hmm. You have to use the first fucking. <laughs> no, I have one. Amberly gave it to me. <laughs> Why did you give that to him? Now he won't do the first rank of the belt. You mean the neck? I'll ne and now I'll never do the neck. I don't need it. <laughs> You know, funny story, uh, you know the neck clicky doesn't work on my pet, because he's, uh, has an illusion. Oh, really? What? It just, yeah, it doesn't affect, uh, the tiger illusion. Oh, I don't even know who my tanks are on I, this side, I'm just in here kicking the shit out of things. Is it a normal thing that sometimes your pet bugs out and you can't shrink him? Yes, that happens. Is there a mechanism... For that, that I can avoid. You have to shrink him as, like, you right after you... Before you zone. Yeah, before you zone. Ah, uh, okay. <laughs> like, right after you summon him, then shrink him. Otherwise, it doesn't work. Yeah, for some fucked up reason, Stupid who knows. Reason. One of those hashtag emu life things. Ever since the source upgrade... Yeah, ever since the source update, it's been fucked up like that. Which one? The one that we did in um, October. Remember, I was around for two of those. Or, well, one, but, you know. You were around for the first one. 
Yes. It has been yes. broken since the second. Gotcha. Durker's just tanking everything. <laughs> yeah. went up. That seems to work. I don't even need to heal you. These things are, are pinner. I'm just going to go full on battle cleric then. Did it die? <laughs> oh, I am. I'm going to get in here. I'm a battle mage. Battle mage. Uh, <laughs> jar 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 jar. We're, we're oh, we're missing a guy. He's walking. I know he's, he's a little, a little guy, guy, but I know I know how much that hurts. I got him. It's okay. That was wow. Turn those grass down. It seems pretty laggy to me too. Yeah, it's a little getting a little loss. What are you talking about? Go go look at the server. Yeah. <laughs> Lagged out, got killed. Yeah, I think half the well group just went linked in. <laughs> yeah, that was uh, not a good thing. Humming along, I was having no issues at all. Zero issues. Zero issues. Or is it uh, non-game pictures in Discord? Looks good to me. Glad I threw that extra ram in it, though. Oh, where'd you download it from? Ram.com. I was gonna say probably Newegg, but Ram.com works. <laughs> Weenusram.com. I would too download a car. <laughs> exactly. If I didn't have to go to a dealership and deal with all the stupidity there, yeah, you're damn right I'd download a car. He says you have to. Order that shit online. I don't. I pick out the one I want, I go in and I tell them this is what I'm going to pay for. And if they say, well, we need to negotiate, I say, fine, fuck off and leave. <laughs> Put up with it. Yep. 
and I usually have a cashier's check with me and says when the check hits the floor, I pick up the check, I tear it up, and I walk the fuck out. Deal or no deal. And I drop it. I've had three salesmen jump over the counter to grab the check. <laughs> it's a fair offer. It's not stupidly low, but it's definitely not what they want for it. They're still making a little profit. Yeah, all you got to do is research what their whole sale is, and then you just about yeah. 30 and then 10% above that. Yep, yeah, that's ten, fair game. 10% above wholesale, and they'll take it every time. It'd be stupid not to. That's an easy sale. Well, I've had a few not take it, but that's fine. I don't give a shit. Oh, shit. I mean, I get it. They got to make a little bit of profit, but they they don't need to make $14,000 on a car in profit. Yeah. Can't help it, everything in me wants to pull them. <laughs> and uh, how do you find that number that you go 10% above? There's a lot of different ways, but you know, if you're real lucky, you got a buddy that works at a dealership and he goes and sneaks a look for you. Nice. If not, then you have to kind of take an average off of the different places and figure it out yourself. I mean, if, if you Google what the wholesale price, dealer price is on a car, you'll get nine different answers for the same vehicle. You just kind of average them out and go with it. And it does vary state to state. But if you walk in with a cashier's check ready to go for the car that you want that's on the lot, they won't turn you down. Like 99 times out of 100. The stupid ones will. Of course, you also have to um, play the odds in your favor. It, it depends on if it's a limited edition or something, though, too. Yeah, I don't do limited editions. Don't give a shit. Last time I went in to buy a car... There was an ice storm going on. They probably hadn't made a sale in a week because nobody was coming in. You know, you, you got to play the odds. You got to go in the best time. And, you know, these guys are hungry. They're not making any money. They're getting chewed on by the sales manager who's getting chewed on by the owner. <laughs> you walk in with money in hand, they're not going to turn it down because then they can go, look, look, we sold the car. Get off our ass. Yeah. Yeah, but you only made fucking 10 points. <laughs> yeah, last last time I bought a truck, I went in and the the, the list value of the truck was fifty seven six. I paid thirty four eight. Oh, good yeah, luck that. buying a truck up here right now. You're paying fucking triple what they should cost. Oh yeah, it's ridiculous. Yeah, it's stupid. I keep trying to convince my girlfriend to sell her car because, uh, like, they're offering, like, $4,000 above what we paid it off for. And I'm just like, dude, sell the damn thing, you know? Yeah, seriously. <laughs> Co-worker no. got in an accident in his truck, and uh, they, uh, it, instead of writing it off, it had, like, $30,000 worth of damage or some shit. They repaired that shit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. Normally they write that kind of stuff off, but I guess trucks are really high up there right now. Yeah. I, I saw something that was making me very happy, and then it made me very sad. I saw Jar Jar's health just—I I saw Jar Jar's health just continuously like going down really fast, and then all of a sudden it goes back up. It made me very sad. <laughs> Yeah, no what? 
Why did that make you sad? It just makes me sad. Look, 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 Jar Jar has a very beautiful corpse, okay? That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> well, I like to play with the ball and it's playing on the ground. Boom. I don't know. These have these have lost a little bit of their shine since uh, since hard mode skirm came. <laughs> it's almost too easy. Yeah, we're, I wouldn't don't have that problem on the east side. Oh, we are obliterating everything over here. That's tempting Murphy. You should not do this. No, this is what I do. <laughs> I think Murphy was an optimist. I think we're fighting lag just as much as the mobs over here. Yeah, badly. Not a little lag. Not much. We also have more of a area than a pile. <laughs> I think it was the Druid Epic Clicky that was doing that, wasn't it? The disconnecting the zone or making the zone crap. Oh, that was the bees back in the day. They've been fixed. They were not working as intended. But they were pretty awesome. Also, not intended. <laughs> Oh, I got an exclamation point reinforcement. Me too. You exist. Yeah, that's the special one. When you kill him, you get a bonus 200 III, right? I forget what that was that was causing that. Nothing. None of them are different. That'd be nice. An extra 200 II just for killing your mom. <laughs> you I it was wish. The vulnerability debuffs. Like where it increases like by 9% damage. I don't know. I do know we might have a mob or two coming in. There's a couple shit. Hiding behind The highest source for visible armor. Hackney, anguish.
There you go. <laughs> of course, every opportunity too. <laughs> that is absolutely sick, Scar. <laughs> oh shit! Woo, got him. Yeah. I don't need it in my shield. I just need a ultimate armor aug v2 throw in there too <laughs> doesn't hold the candle i mean it's uh, it's a little it's over it's over half as good come on it's getting there it's getting there Zero. <laughs> Cats in her chains. That shit's just crazy because it's all all. Well, and it goes in multiple slots, too. Yeah, she's got it in all those slots. <laughs> she doesn't like to change her equipment when she prestiges. Sounds like too much work, so I just throw input. Yep. <laughs> Works for all classes. Good to go. One way to go. Telling you, when you gotta change like one piece. Yeah, your weapon. <laughs> change your That's primary and secondary. Still, still too much effort. I just go without a weapon. <laughs> right, fishing rod. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Yeah, that. There you go. Where's the universal all all weapon? Why haven't you forced me to create that yet? You have that. It's called the flame. Yeah, you already have that. Dragonlance. Ah, fair. Yeah. And the Batman. Mm-hmm. Some kind of... That thing changes it. Yeah, that's the that's the prestige weapon of choice for sure. Yeah. Yeah, but that's not endgame rated. Yeah. You should make something like the fluffy pillow of suffocation. <laughs> that sounds awesome. <laughs> I I want one. <laughs> Wait, is there a pi there must be a pillow icon there, there has is. to be. There's a pillow icon. There has to be. Yeah, that sounds Tom's amazing. Running there through. Is, is there a uh, I'll have to Sounds a little risky to me. <laughs> you know, right click effect pillow fight. We're too busy talking and not pulling the name down. You're too busy talking. Here, come over here, buddy. See, I think that's why Scar wanted to be a cleric, so he doesn't have to pull anymore. I'm trying to pull as it is. <laughs> Need to prestige back over to Ranger. Boo. <laughs> no, I actually, I'm really enjoying cleric. It's pretty fun. Deeps. Yeah, of all the classes I prestige through, I enjoyed Druid the most, other than what I play. Okay. 
hated Druid class. No offense to Emberly, but I hate it. <laughs> we can't like everything. I am not a figure regular in any way, shape, or form. <clears throat> I'm just going to go crazy next and prestige into a chanter. Oh, well, then maybe you can work on getting this uh, Chander pets like I was talking about last night. <laughs> <laughs> then there'd be 8,000 Chanters on the server. That'd be pretty sick. It would be. What? Nothing. Okay. Two 3.0 is your job. Nice. <laughs> Pretty epic story. Yeah. It's Friday. Okay. Some heavy breathing going on. <laughs> happening over there <laughs> yo ho no son an idiot's purpose never done <laughs> man that one was frustrating oh yeah I'm not looking forward to that Keep tab targeting champ's pet. And I'm like, why am I not attacking? Damn, Zerker, Beast, and Necro. Which one are you doing last? Rogue took four hours? Wow, that's fast. Yeah, he pre-looted everything and then then switched and it was done in like four hours. It's crazy. <laughs> nice. Doing a bunch a shit ton of combines and hand ins and shit. Yeah, and I I helped him with the final fights, so I was there for it. Awesome. Yeah, I like tropical melons too. But probably not the kind used in EverQuest. Yeah, same here. So I've cured the dog of wanting to go out 55 times a day. Okay, how'd you do that? Put a shock collar on, been using the vibrate for about six months. Today she pulled her crap, she went outside, didn't do anything, and every time she'd come back towards the door, I shot the piss out of her. <laughs> Why? That, that probably works. That's the best way to uh, train a dog, I imagine. It, it works. Because just now I got a call. You know, the dog needed out, so I hit the button from down here, and the collar vibrated, and I hear, never mind. She went and laid down. I thought, yeah, uh-huh. <laughs> nice. Well, what it is is they don't get a treat unless they go outside and do their business. That's uh. how my parents trained them. Well, it's been that way for 15 years, and they decide, oh, I want a treat. Let's go outside for two seconds, screw around, then we come back and we get a treat. Right, that makes sense, yep. So now... The, the treat is you don't get your ass burned when you go outside and don't do your business. <laughs> That's a pretty That's good treat. treat. Mm -hmm. Somebody read the book on negative reinforcement. 
Negative reinforcement <laughs> is the best reinforcement. It's the only one that Neither actually will continue works. Until the morale improves. And it works. Yeah, slow roast them. <laughs> <laughs> but I haven't gotten any more false had to go up there and they didn't go out and do their business because if I let them out I will literally stand there 45 minutes and burn the shit out of them every time they come towards the door if they haven't done their business it took twice they got the hang of it <laughs> Now, when they say they went out, and I buzz it, and they don't run back to their bed or wherever they're at, I know they're serious. Who says you can't teach an old dog new tricks? There you go. That now I don't have to come up out of my man cave twenty-five times a day. The dog is serious now. Mm-hmm. And they get to wear the collars for the next three months. And every time they pull one of their shenanigans, I'm going to burn them. And after about three months, I figure I won't have to anymore. I mean, I've got it back to vibrate as a warning every time. And it seems to be enough because they know what comes after vibrate. I definitely know who I'm not asking to a dog sit. <laughs> well, I, I tested the collars on me first. I want to know how bad it zapped them. Because you know, I'm not going to. But it doesn't actually hurt that bad. No. Yeah. No, I turned it up on the highest setting and zapped myself, and I was like, well, that kind of tingled. You know, because it's for a little dog. They were like 14 pounds. I can't use much juice. <laughs> That's why you got to rewire it. <laughs> Hook it well, up to you know, a couple jumper cables and that car battery. Yeah, that's my next step. If this didn't work, I was actually going to wire it to the 440 coming into the house. Oh, Fuck that, I was going to cry. <laughs> that's insane. <laughs> I'm done. See, then I'd have popcorn dogs. They'd literally pop, and then they'd be everywhere. Gross. That's not a visual anyone wanted, damn. <laughs> <laughs> the voices in my cat's head demand it. <laughs> nice. Oops. Well, that's what I get for healing Emberly. <laughs> well, you remember that psycho son of Sam, right? The voices in his no. dog's head made him kill the people. Back in the seventies. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Thank you. I died. It's officially a raid. I'd be worried about the uh, voices in my head, but I don't speak Dutch, so. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know what they're saying. Mine are usually saying something about go eat all the chocolate donuts, but you know. <laughs> oh, the voices tell me to do that. Yeah, they were. Holy shit, Perrin has a huge crow with him. Yes, he does. That is yes. insane. You need, you need to, to make, make that, that crow yellow, yellow and name it Big, Big Bird. Bird. <laughs> <laughs> no, I really wanted him to be with a so. wolf. I gotta change it. We don't have falcon, falcon models, do we? No. No. Yeah. We definitely need those. Huh. Who's it that has the wolves now? It's the, um... That's just, that's that's just, just a quick, quick retext, really, though, so... Human. He used to be a barbarian. Oh, yeah. If he was barbarian, he would have a wolf. And that would make more sense. Yeah, yeah definitely not carrying any silverware either. He won't be any different because you didn't repop the zone and you can't do that oh, currently. Heap of fain. Why'd you do it? <clears throat> what do we got? Like seven minutes left? Something like that? 
1730. Oh, I was so close. <laughs> there was a seven involved. There wasn't there seven. Was I was seven. close. <laughs> Did you know he's got two spaces in his name? Really? Yeah. Oh, look at that. That is, that's weird. Yeah. But he's shouting, so all is well. Just let you know. Hmm. What the hell is that noise? But I've changed him. He's now barbarian. Oh, okay. Well, next Friday, we'll see him again. Thunder bunnies, ho! I've been rarely hitting it as well. Ever since I changed. <laughs> Well, you should be hitting it more now that you're a mage. Should be on your rotation. Yeah, it does more damage now. Yeah. Yeah. Just rename it to the Bong of Thunder. You'll hit it all the time. <laughs> That's good advice. Mm-hmm. It cracks me up because the vape store that I go to is also a head shop. I know, and too. We were in there the other day, and the wife's like, What are those for up there? And I'm like, Nothing. <laughs> Did it again. It phases, yes. The bottom part pops out so you can easily refill the water in them. Yeah, so the, group, the group is split, so I can't watch what's going on over there and what's going on over here. No, don't, don't watch me then. Don't watch me. I'm good. If I'm not good, that's my fault. The funniest one they've got up there on the shelf, it's this one that looks like a gigantor deck. Make, back up. Makes sense. Yeah, you load it through the balls, you light the balls on fire. <laughs> They're everywhere. They're a little everywhere, but everyone's living. That I can target easily, at least. Oops. I don't really like the fact that I was AOE with Shaz. Almost killing him? Omvor hit the floor there. Holy shit. <laughs> Almost, though. I mean, looks pretty dead to me. <laughs> <laughs> Unless you die so hard you go link dead, you haven't made a proper pull yet. <laughs> Used to do that all the time. And yeah. Too. I was going to say, back in 2018, we'd go to the, the grounds. Oh, no, you don't, Tom. And uh, I'd pull it and drag it all back in. And then, you know, our SK in the group would hit his clicky. The ranger would hit his clickies. I'd hit my clickies. <clears throat> brace for impact. And we'd have something targeted. You know, we'd all go link dead. <laughs> and we'd come back and either made a shit ton of AA or be in the lobby and laugh about it. Rinse and repeat. <laughs> That's a fun tactic. <laughs> it was awesome. It's 50 50 odds whether we live through it or not. I mean, you know, and if we died, we'd go link dead because, you know, it'd just kill us that hard. Of course. It's always fun getting hit that hard. Corpus loved it. 
<laughs> oh, Corpus Wood. Corpus isn't talking. I remember doing grounds on my necro and lagging out because of all the text spam. Gotta shrink that shit. Yeah, gotta filter that. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Uh, turn your turn your logs off. <laughs> oh, log, logs were off. Yeah, turn your logs off. Put all that crap in another window and minimize it. Yep. yep. And I was still lagging out. Wow. Yeah, it was good. Bad. But my yeah, my other computer was absolute shit though. So, you Pop know, our grand processor. No, no, it was it was an Intel, but oh, it was yep. a Mattel brand. Yeah, that explains Mat it. Mattel, yeah, Mattel. Oh, thank you. Fisher Price, my first PC. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, Intel makes those too. They call them Pentiums. <laughs> you had a Fisher Price PC too? I did. I've, I've never owned one of those. <laughs> oh, no. Commodore 64. Hey, don't knock the Commodore 64. Well, I did it all. It's fantastic. It had some great games back in the day. Yes, it did. I had, I had a toaster. If you guys know what a toaster is. An Amiga. Oh, I love the Amigas. I had an Amiga video toaster. Those things were so far ahead of their time. Oh, my God. I actually got to use that thing for six or seven years before it really started getting antiquated. Yep. Back in that day, you were antiquated in six months. Yeah. Weren't they yeah. one of the first to do like raster graphics and such? Uh huh. And they also, the, I mean, the, the toaster was the best video rendering machine on the planet for yep. a decade. Yep. Long after there were better processors, the toaster was still better. Yep. Because a, a buddy of mine actually was doing a lot of rendering. Me out of it. I didn't want to, you know, want to use it anymore as my main machine. Right. She got a lot of use out of it. I think he used it another four or five years before it wasn't as good as what you buy anymore. Which is crazy. Didn't the Amiga use the RISC chipset? Yep. Yep. Thought they so. did. Yep. They were the, the first personal computer to use RISC. Mm -hmm. And then Cirix came along and was using RISC, but they ran like really, really hot. You went, oh, we'll just buy them. <laughs> That's where the technology came from. They dropped into like the Ryzen series. Yeah. It took them a while to perfect it, but they did it. The Ryzen series isn't all that stable. Really? I'm not, oh, I have a, a 5600X, and I'm not, not all that impressed with it. Now you must have got a bad one. Well, it's um, obvious. I've got five Ryzen sitting in here, and I've got two Threadripper Gen 2 sitting in here, and I have no problems with any of them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I think that has a lot to do with it. I'm running a Radeon Vega 64. Well, there's your problem. Yeah. It's your video card. It's not the chip. Yeah. A cooling unit. That's a great fucking idea. The background sheet works is on all my main problems. Yeah. Well, when I built this thing, it was, uh, you know, I mean, like, the G-Forces were just, like, full of everything going with it. All other video cards were just really, really expensive and you could get them. Yep. I haven't looked recently, but my days were really dropped. Holy crap. I just picked up a 3990 for the discount that I get. And I will pay fifteen hundred bucks for it. That's still a little expensive. Not 
obviously the trade, but on the open market, it's not. But still, it's still, 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 still,
<laughs> That's great. Oh, cats with the zinger. If you missed that, cats prefers the up weenus cycles. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, that doesn't sound right. That could be detrimental to Grail. <laughs> Tingly. <laughs> Like not killing all of the other mobs. Uh, we got a minute left. We're just looking for me. Yeah, okay. Then when that spawn helps spawn them. No, no, no. There's no. Sixty seconds. Yeah, we've killed more than enough to spawn whatever names we're gonna get. So many names. There's so many names over here. You guys don't have any named over there. Come over here. Oh, there's one finally. Yeah, we've got, we've got, got like five. <laughs> you know, you can always design it so that the kills we do over here respond to names over there and vice versa. We just spell on the name. It'd be like Tetris battle, you can just overwhelm the other side. <laughs> <laughs> Right. Kirk's <laughs> like, yeah, we can do this. <laughs> yeah, and then your side, whatever side wins, uh, gets gets the points, and the other side gets nothing. If we get double and you get nothing, or vice versa. But it's based on the side of your side. Right, yeah, the side of your side. There you go. Oh, man. Uh, we almost got that last guy. We almost got the last guy. Yeah. Six fifty six. Holy shit. Wow, that's really good. Is that a new record even? I think it is. I think it is. I think it it's it's certainly in the running, but it's not. I haven't seen that eye without getting a double page or a double. Yeah, I don't think it's ever Yeah, because six times slow six hundred. Well, yeah, I had double points. Oh, shit, I crashed. Six hundred fifty-six million. Congrats, guys. Good run. That was a hell of a run. That was nice. We'll be hitting up uh, Fable Tack V next. You're after the IHR. Able to do that. Something to do that. We didn't lose any. Oops. Well done. Wow, no no Forsaken down? No Forsaken down. The last Who's record I see being posted is 394, so we absolutely destroyed it. On. 31. Yeah, but that was double points. We were just doing single points there. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, so 6, 10, 22. It looks like we got double rewards, but there's only 631 EXP tips. Okay. Or did last week was 542. Hmm. New record. I think that's the one. I I think that's the new record, yeah. Yeah, I believe that's the new record. I guess I've been forgetting Oh, you don't want to know how many I have. <laughs> I don't turn them in. Okay. 
Nice. Oh, so close. Uh, even let's even your goblins. Let's all go to the lobby. Oh, you're getting a picture of the carnage? Nice. <laughs> yeah. One in there. Oops. They did much better job of removing quotes to work with some of the Oh yeah, keeping it tidy. Yeah, this is so tidy I can't find a corpse to take a picture of. Oh wait, I found one. <laughs> They didn't die over there, that's why. That's what happened. They're just too good. Actually, it's the first time I ever died on this garbage in forever. Jeremy's the only one who uh, left the corpse. Wow. I had to go. Oh, okay. That's probably a good idea. Tempted to steal another. You better do so before I put it away. Durker's trying to ninja kick me. Is that the leather? The leather looks fucking awesome on a Nixar. You look like a football player. You play football. <laughs> That's buffing. Hello there, Governor. Look at this pack. You guys are lucky I don't have a flamethrower in this game. <laughs> or pipe can attest to that. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that was sorry. I'm trying to say this without crying. That was glorious. <laughs> that game's pretty awesome. Is it for the level 100? Uh, yeah. Arnock, are you coming? That's only ten in a row. Okay. Yeah. still yeah. better than that. Yeah. Yeah, except you get the uh, extended bus duration for beneficial not bothered. <laughs> Charge her with the exact number. Yeah, he has a spreadsheet. <laughs> <laughs> of course he does. All right, here we go.
Now entering Fabled Tech Feed. All right, let's tonight. Thanks, guys. I'm on the morning crew, so I won't be with you in fact. But uh, you guys have a great evening and a great weekend, and I'll see you all tonight. All right. All right, cheers, Zan. Have a good one, man. Later. Sure. Let's go. Oh, you're already going. We are going. I'm sorry, Josh. I didn't even. I was like, yeah, I'm the only one here. I can play this. Oh, I saw we're like two purple swords sitting there. It's funny. Whoa. Like, why do Poppers are telling me that I'm in the instance? Because I'm running around on the roof. Ooh. No wonder I'm not getting the red messages. That'll do it. Yeah. Just be Tom Boo Boo instead of Cat Joe. Yeah, be playing the wrong character. Yeah. Wrong character. Oops. Huh. This place is a cakewalk now. So the patch are being broken today sucked. <laughs> Everybody's all better now, though. You know, I, I, as a, just a matter of coincidence, I, I have the patcher on one monitor, and I have the old. You know, original whatever patch me version on my other and for whatever reason I just didn't use the patch at all today so I didn't know what anybody was talking about. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I was like I don't have what are these guys all talking about? <laughs> what do you mean you're having a problem? There's no problem. You guys are crazy. I, I was like everything's worse than mine. I don't even know. <laughs> <laughs> I checked this morning. I knew that there was an issue. Uh, I we already knew what it was and knew how to fix it. By the time we were starting work, we just had to work. Yeah, just had to go to work. <laughs> <laughs> so it had to wait. Curses, darn work, interfering with our gaming. Yeah, that's the sucky part about work. Plus, you're being work from home. Well, you know. Probably wouldn't get a lot of work done. <laughs> well, half my job is just traffic and adjust accordingly if things start to get bottlenecked. Hmm. Hey, but you know, being a proper IT guy, you know, I'm overpaid when they don't need me because everything's working right. And I'm competent the minute anything breaks because I'm just a good job. <laughs> <laughs> You know, my job, I've been confident 24 7 to answer billing questions for Comcast. So. Oh, 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 uh, Man, I get, I get people who are upset because their internet bill is fifty dollars. That's almost a car payment. Uh, whose car are you? Whose car do you have? Oh, they got it from Wish.com, man. Before you, a guy called me up today and said, uh, "Hey, uh, I'm house sitting, um, and I accidentally ordered Playboy. Can you remove that?" Uh, well, can you authenticate the account? No, I don't have any of her account number or anything. Then I can't help you. 
Because I can't get into her account unless you authenticate. <laughs> the dude's got a twenty dollar charge for Playboy channel, and he's gonna have to explain that to the lady he pals with. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you might as well get the most of it <laughs> at that point. Yeah, second-hand embarrassment for him when he was talking to me. Uh, that is called friend shop. <clears throat> That's hilarious. Yeah, my job sucks. <laughs> <laughs> most, most of my time, I'm setting up cloud servers, taking down cloud servers, and even removing people as they get hired and fired. You know. Programs and fix it. One of the managers of departments think they know how to run the IT department better than I do. And because it's an R&D facility for the company I work for, you can't bring a personal phone into the FBI home office. Mm. Yeah. Corporate secrets and all. Yeah. Is that not good? So, Espionage. This one guy was bringing a Blackberry in. Because it wasn't phone, it was Blackberry. And I caught him with it because I had to be in the office one day. I'm like, dude, what do you have a Blackberry in here? He knows it's your phone. He goes, that's, that's not a phone, that's a Blackberry. So I popped open, looked at his IP address, and sent him a call from my laptop. Like, it's a phone. Uh, give me. He kind of looked at me, and I'm like, but if I could tap into it that fast, then you probably cost the company millions of dollars. Give me. So he handed me the phone and I threw it out the 43rd floor. Woof. Bye. Right. Sexy up there. That's how I dealt with it. He was pissed. Said he'd have me fired. And I'm like, no, sorry. My security showed up to fire me. There's no question. There's a zero tolerance policy for phones in the building. There's no question to ask. You're just terminated. You know, maybe the big sign when you're coming in that says, please check all phones with security. In letters that are three feet tall. You know people can't read. <laughs> right. <That's> my problem. <laughs> they can learn not to read at the unemployment office after I'm doing mine. They figure it out real quick. But I mean, this is where the company develops new products. You know, they could potentially be billion dollar IPs. So they have to keep tight security. You know, think, think about it. If they come up with something that's like next big Velcro and it gets stolen, how much money is that going to cost them? Yeah, it's of course, it's Yeah, of course. The margins are much better. Yeah, there's only like an 800% markup on cell phones. Margins? They will literally ridicule you during COVID. You didn't try to put a cell phone in front of the head, but call. They call us. Call oh. us. Yeah. Last thing I'm thinking about when I'm calling Comcast is a phone. Yeah. <laughs> exactly. Hey, my TV sucks. Can you sell me a phone? Thank you, Durger. That was Durger. That's not me. Yeah, that's that's what I was exactly picturing. Where you get the the people? Uh, so my my husband just recently passed, and I want to get my his name taken off and put my name. Cool, cool, cool. So can I interest you in the iPhone 13 Pro Max? Yeah. <laughs> so you, you guys want to hear something really funny? And I I verified this information. Actually tested it. You know how when uh, iPhone users are talking to Droid users on FaceTime, and it's always a shitty connection. Okay. Go no, over. It's not uh... possible. There is software in the iPhone that detects who you're sending the data to, and if it's detected as a droid, it automatically lowers it to a, a worse resolution than possible. Yeah, it's no surprise at all, right? I mean, you know, just look at look, look at the whole text message debacle between uh, you know between Apple and, and, and Android right now. 
Well, they do it intentionally from Apple. Oh, yeah. Of course they did. Well, I had two identical Apple products and two identical Droid products, oh. and I tested their communications in physically the exact same spot. Yep. And they worked beautifully as Droid to Droid <laughs> or Apple to Apple. But as soon as I threw an Apple to a Droid, the Apple automatically downgraded its video yep. resolution for no reason. Yep. And so I unlocked it, which was no small feat, and I hacked through the back end, and I found the code, and it's there. Yep. There you go. Don't buy Apple products. They're bastards. Yeah, Apple yeah. products have worms. And if you think I'm kidding, you should see the spyware that's built into them. Their worms oh, have worms. <laughs> Literally. Everything you do is logged and sent back for processing for marketing purposes. Yep. Their worms have worms. <laughs> <laughs> I, I like yeah. that. And there's actually planned obsolescence code in the phone, too. Mm -hmm. It's a 36-month. After 36 months, they automatically degrade the performance of the phone 10%. Sounds about right. Yep. After 48 months, they degrade the performance of the phone 48% or 40%. And they it, they claim it's for the uh, to preserve battery life. No, mm -hmm. that's the best part about it. Sounds you know, legit. Once you de Google a, a Google <clears throat> phone, the battery lasts about three times longer. Yeah. Of course, with my droid, I charge it once every three days. <laughs> Works perfectly. Yep. Boom! We win! It's game over! Game yeah, over, man! Unfortunately, I think it's about time I get me a, a new new droid. Mine's, uh, mine's about four years old now. It's about <laughs> <laughs> Can I interest you in one of our mobile plants? Or the Xfinity, you know we have $45 unlimited plan. <laughs> I will cut. <laughs> my, my current LG phone that I need to replace is eight years old. It has a 1080p display, and it's still got more features and functions than the latest Apple, whatever. Oh, yeah. Is. I absolutely love my phone. I have a OnePlus Lost 6. Uh, and it, it's a wonderful <laughs> phone. Um, but, like, I'm finding, like, I have to charge it every couple days now. Oh, I replaced the battery in mine once, but the problem is I could buy a brand new phone for less money oh, than I could buy my next replacement too. battery. Yep, yep. So, you know, yeah. I'm just going to get a newer, newer version. Hey, Uncle Owen, this droid's got a bad motivator. <laughs> <laughs> I only pitched that because I just had a feeling I was talking about mobile. I just had a, like... PTSD that my supervisor was going to pop up out of nowhere. It's just, hey, why didn't you pitch mobile to him? <laughs> you know, well, you know, my favorite one is Apple actually paid lobbyists to convince congressmen and senators, because they're not very smart people, that if you take an Apple product to a non-authorized Apple repair center and they repair it with genuine Apple parts, it miraculously becomes a PC. What? That's, that, that's how it works, yeah. Makes a lot of sense. Yeah, there's a guy on, on YouTube. Uh, it's the Rossman Group, and he's a, he's an Apple guy. He's got some cool toys. He's got wave solder machines and all kinds of stuff. But anyway, <laughs> he's a lobbyist for right to repair, and you should see the bullshit that they do. Oh, yeah. We ready? Everybody it's, got their rewards? It's silly. All right, let's roll. <clears throat> Destroy. You know, I remember when you used to be able to get a two-year contract with a phone company and they'd give you the phone for free. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I miss, I miss that. Those were the good old days, but then phones didn't cost $1,500. <laughs> phones shouldn't cost $1,500 now. Well, you're carrying around a computer in your pocket. <laughs> well, well, yeah, but there's, there's no reason for a phone to cost $1,500, right? No. Right. There's no reason for one to cost more than, like, 300 bucks, honestly. The little Motorola processors in a droid, you know, oh, they're like you know, 75 cents a piece to stamp yeah. out because they're not anything super high tech. Yeah. They're like 15 or 20 year old PC technology. These are not the droids you're looking for. Now, granted, there's more technology in that cell phone than the mass of mainframes that send people to the moon, but you know, that's another story. 
forgot my flask of courage. No courage? No courage. Wait, you sent people to the moon? Mm-hmm. Not really. It's yes, but it's not in the videos that you saw. <laughs> well, you see, Plus, the thing is, they, they hired Stanley Kubrick to do the filming, you know, to fake the moon landings, but he's such a, a pe you know, stickler for authenticity that he made them send them all to the moon to, to film the fake landing. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? That is the best thing I have heard about that. True to me. Uh, no. Nope. The, you know the Earth really is definitely really flat. Stupid. Don't listen to those people. You know what the really stupid bullshit is? If you got a good enough telescope and you look at the Sea of Tranquility, you can see what's left of the lunar module and the American flag up there. Yep. I want to go back, though, to something we were talking about earlier, about how, like, pushing, you know, like, Comcast trying to push cell phones. Th that's bad enough. We now you see Apple going, hey, you know, that kind of work. Let's start pushing internet service. Well, oh, God, yeah. <laughs> no, the, one that, the one that gets me every single time is when I have to call the bank. And oh. they start I, I, Can I get they a start pushing, yeah. like, you know, is it okay if I tell you about, you know, these products? And I'm like, but no, it's not okay if you tell me about these products. See, we've we've done past that. I don't ask your permission. I just tell you about it. Yeah. <laughs> well, I get the feeling they 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 have to ask for permission for some reason. I otherwise yeah. otherwise they wouldn't do it. But you know, so yeah. But well, thank you yeah. for the thank you for See, the raid. Um, Apple's gonna start Thanks this offering out. of iNet here before long. Yeah, it's it's the first hundred megs is free. Who's that? And then the next hundred count? megs cost you a dollar, but anything over that is an upcharge at four ninety nine a megabyte. Yeah, no. Had that kind of limitation in New Zealand back in the day. It was awful. Honestly, I expected Apple to do that ten years ago. Yeah, honestly, I did too. You know, get every. Thought I hey, is is there anything in the forums about like some of this currency, like the orums and stuff? Maybe you'd probably have to dig. <laughs> yes. Hard. What would you like to know? <laughs> yeah. What do you want to know? <laughs> Instead of yeah. asking, so you, you have an AI wiki here. Just ask. That question is sufficiently vague for me to say yes. <laughs> Like, you got the yeah, I mean, just right ask now. what you're what you're ask. wondering about, and we'll help you. Yeah. I'm just wondering where 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 do you where do you, how how exactly some of this currency works, and that, where do you use it? Okay, you use the currency with the proper guy that takes the currency. Yeah. So so for example, Aura, that. right? So for example, Aura. If you go up to either Ash or Bad Ash, right click okay. on him. Yeah, it's just like a merchant. Yeah, you, there's stores. You, Tells you how much orm you have available. That shows you what you can buy. Make oh. sure you make sure you open your inventory and go to the alt currency tab <laughs> and you know click the box that says show currencies that you don't have, and then you click the currency you want and you reclaim them because they got to be in your alt currency inventory to use them. They're right. in your bags. Okay. They don't work. Yeah, if it's just in your bag or on your cursor, you're doing it wrong. <laughs> right. Okay, how exactly do the experience shift work? That's just something that you use for AAs. Okay. Same works the yeah. same way from another vendor. Yeah. Okay. The There's yeah, okay. two AA vendors in the lobby. One that uh, will exchange the small XP chips for the next size up, and then the other one does that size into the really big ones to save them up. You can then mm -hmm. hand them in one at a time. To those NPCs. Yeah, the AA vendors, you give them the XP chips one at a time, and they'll give you the AAs. So the best thing gotcha. to do is convert it up to a large or a huge XP chip and save yourself a lot of turn-ins. Right. Yeah. <laughs> ah, okay. 
So if you have 100 XP chips, you want to change those into a large XP chip and then turn that in and get the 500 yeah, AA like all at once. Two clicks versus 100 clicks. Right. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay, that makes sense. And Orum, you earn those by doing the retail, which we just did, of course, and, and skirmishes and uh, the assaults and, and raids from... Uh, Quartermaster Ash and Bad Ash. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. Now I know where that goes. Thank you so much. No problem. And Orum's used for, for upgrading your greedy goblin augs into the version 2 of them. Mm -hmm. Among various other goodies and bips and bobs that they have. So to upgrade a greedy go goblin og, you have to have the greedy goblin og, like you know, uh, the serpent yeah, one or the viper or whatever the hell it's called. Bite of the serpent. Or something. Bite of the serpent. Yeah. Yes, that's the one I'm thinking of. Thank you. Uh, so you need to have the original og, then you have to buy the enhancer item from the ash, right? Quartermaster enhancing, ash. Enhancing doodad. And then you need the down. doodad to combine those two items in, and then you'll get yeah, the V two. The doodad the container. And yes, it actually is called the doodad. That's, that's... That, that is its name. <laughs> it's the doodad. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay. Yes. When you're looking at the merchant, it will make sense. Yeah. Yeah. It'll make more sense looking at the merchant. Yes, Gimpy, you can buy bags of I or on Fat Ash. I think they're on good ash too, honestly. Yeah, you can buy bags of III, but I don't recommend it. And you can buy the tourist deal if you really want to be silly. What's that? You know, you don't remember all that. The uh, it's like a level ten, right, for fifteen hundred. Oh right, yeah, yeah. It's it's even funnier now though, right, because you've got the converted tron. <laughs> yeah. Right, gotcha. right. Level 10 is the T deal, the Taurus deal. I gotcha, that makes sense. <laughs> I should probably just take those off there now. It was, it was. <laughs> it, was a, it was a period of time where we were messing with him on a weekly basis about what nerve he was going to put in next or whatever. <laughs> there you go. Enjoy. <laughs> Fuckers. That was, that was fantastic. <laughs> you need another beverage, my love. Yeah. Probably. Soon. We'll give her a gummy and she can start yelling at us all again. <laughs> but these things happen. That was so funny that night. Oh, I get to draw a card? Look at me go. I'm not even watching to draw. I didn't even draw two. What the hell's happening here? I can't be right. Come on, Joker. <laughs> what? <clears throat> we win. I not miss getting feared. Oh, did you use your flask? No, I did not have a flask yet. I um, bought it. It just hasn't been in here in a minute. Mm -hmm. I remember why I hate this zone. <laughs> yeah, I like the I like the fear mechanic. There's much nastier things you can do than fear. Fear is like so 1999. <laughs> are the are the twins still alive? Looks like it. Somebody else is fighting those things. Mm. We had the above called seizure, and oh, yeah. everyone turns into that thing the corpus turns into. Oh god! <laughs> that would be, that'd be uh, awesome. That might just crash zones. <laughs> you know, or something really, really cool where you've got little raised platforms, and when the guy screams, the floor is lava. If you don't jump up on the platform, fifty k of tick damage. <laughs> Reads your Z. <laughs> So, yep. Ember and Sogar could just go AFK during that fight. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Wait, where the hell is Jorleg going? Mm -hmm. Taking the scenic route. 
I think you had a phone call. It's going to go out, step out and take it real quick. He wants to switch to Comcast. Yeah. He needs one of those Google phones. Right. Mm, yes. Slow and silent. That's good shit. That's a fun fight. If only it was harder. <laughs> right? It's worked out though. I spent so long trying to figure out how to make that fucking the the guardians work in that friggin' battle. <laughs> and I've never oh. seen them actually activate during an actual event as a player. <laughs> oh, for AGN. Yeah, for the Dylan fight, yeah. Is that north? No. Yeah? No, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah it is, yeah. yeah that's, it's like, it's very painful for me right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes. Is there, is there any particular reason that's so painful for you? He's, he's going to get a plus two before he gets the regular I, one. I think so, yeah. I mean... It's just incredibly annoying to run every day. <laughs> I stopped running it because I'm like, forget this. We all ran into the wall. That was awesome. That was insane. Boing! I was hoping to farm a spare and make a few million plat off of it. But it's not worth the effort. Not at 45 minutes a day to run that silly event. Over and over. Hi. Went from nothing to 191 yesterday. Nice, wow. grats. So That's close. Fair. Nine levels and you got Ultima. He probably made enough tonight to go those last nine levels. I don't know about that. Maybe. Maybe. Two characters, 1,200, he'd be close. He'd be close, I guess. He got 600. It would be really close. Yeah, you'll be at like nine ninety nine. Oh, they're going. I'm fearless. Uh, I'm already bounced. Jeez. Might not be feared, but I'm stunned. Now this egg's gonna yeah, crack. That's... There's no way. That's my usual. If they, if they can't fear me, they stun me. Woo! That was close. Oh, I don't have a banana. Eggs up. Matter up. Rup, rup. Let's -a go. <laughs> well, it's almost fear time. It's a me. Do you remember way back in the day when you get feared and they wouldn't put Link dead above your head when you were feared? You just slowly start walking around. Everybody be like, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> well, do you know why they put LD above everybody's head for when you got feared? Because other people would turn on walk and just walk around instead yep. of doing what they were supposed to do? Yep. We actually caught them on raids back in the day against Box and Nagy. They just slowly walk around the room not doing a damn thing. The entire fight. That's hilarious. <laughs> yeah catch him at it because you couldn't be called a hero if you were feared so we'd call him real quick and when they got called over we'd just kick him out right right because you know that was back when it took 72 people to kill that guy throwing boulders <laughs> yeah. 
It's pretty awesome. That's a great way to get around it. Yeah, I remember that. Yeah, because they weighed a ton, literally. Yeah, you'd be... It's not naggy. You'd um, take them out of your weight reduction bag and put them in an empty slot. Didn't matter what happened, you were there. See, that's just smart, though. That's good tactics. Superior tactics. Uh -huh. Roll! Crush, crush. Yeah, some of the stuff in Seeds of Destruction, the events were pretty cool too, because you had to protect a guy from the boss, and the boss would go straight at him, so you had to snap aggro. And he's like, how dare you interfere with me? And he'd call for his minions, and like four minions would show up, you had to snap aggro, or they'd kill the guy. Don't I have something like that with uh, Avalanche style? Kind of, yeah. But Except I'm this guy was, was rooted in the middle, and you okay. literally had to grab these guys because they came in with him pre-targeted and casting. Oh, mm -hmm. I'm walking. You had, to, you had to get stuns off on him instantly. The Channers had to stun them when they showed up. Or the four of them, oh. when they landed their nukes, would kill him. Because they came in casting. Even if you snapped aggro, they'd finish the spell if they didn't get interrupted. And if, three, and if three of the four landed, he died, event failed. You're done for the, the raid. That's a really good idea. I'm not writing that down right now at all. <laughs> then, uh, yeah. <laughs> Then there was a, another event where you had to let a ranger solo it until he died at least five times before it would unlock the mob's hit points. <laughs> I was also not writing that one down. <laughs> Who says we haven't already put that uh, in? That would, that would, you guys wouldn't even notice that he put that in on this server. <laughs> <laughs> I do remember the event where the, the uh, pets had to beat the mob down the first 10%. Because anybody else that went in in that time frame just died instantly. It was like getting hit with a death touch. You literally had to pet tank him for the first 10 or 20 percent. Oh. Dang it. I meant to drink some liquid courage. Got behind the wall in time. I just fell through the fucking wall. <laughs> well, Link dead. Oh, and then I popped back up. Sweet. I'll take it. Yeah, I've Link dead it through the wall and then popped back up. I think I'm the Rampage tank now. <laughs> oh, let's just FD that off. But you remember when you'd get charmed on live and all of a sudden your character became super badass and was unkillable? Because you'd get NPC mob stats all of a sudden with raid armor on? Last scene, Necro. We had a monk that got charmed just as we gated out to the Nexus. And so he's dire charmed, basically, in the Nexus. And he runs around and he wipes out like three quarters of the people sitting in the Nexus before it wore off. It was funny as hell. I don't know if you remember that or not, Corpus. No, I don't remember that. Yeah, it was uh, 
God, I can't remember what, what era it was in, but we popped back into the Nexus just oh. as he got charmed because we beat the event. Yeah, see, that's, that's impossible here because Nexus is a no-fight zone. <laughs> yeah, it wasn't a no-fight zone on live. But we popped in, or we gated just as he got charmed, and so he ended up, because of the timing, he went with us. And he literally wiped the zone out. You know, this monk on live was hit for like 5k, it was insane. I did die, yes. Because, because he was in PC stat, status. <laughs> and he was in full raid armor, so he was like ridiculously hard to kill. I can, uh, I right, right. Sorry. Back in Wrath of the Lich King, um, yeah, on WoW, I was in the, one of the top rating guilds for, for 10 man, and, uh, one of the things we would do is when someone would get charmed, we would all dogpile him and make sure he died. We would stop at whatever we were doing on the boss or anything didn't matter if we wiped you had to kill that person and we would we would wipe a lot because of that a lot of our progression was was kind of fettered by that but we did that and then we also would roll as we were doing the boss fights we would we would random for massive amounts of currency <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, at the time there was that that mammoth that you could buy for 120,000 gold. Oh, I remember that. Mm -hmm. Yep, that's how I got mine. Won a 60,000 gold bet. <laughs> Just <laughs> it would get more exciting as it went on because everyone would lose all their money, and then like two people at the end would just like one person walk out of there with gold, and everyone else was broke. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite was to play a hunter, and I'd go over and charm one of those monkeys that would fling poo at people. What? You know, what was that? Um, fairly early on, but you could charm a monkey, and I can't remember where, but one of his attacks, I'm not charmed, but tame a monkey as your yeah. pet, and he would fling poo at people. That's <laughs> pretty cool. Yeah. I don't think I knew that. And the only reason I went and got one is because I could throw poo at people. That's, I, I got the uh, one from my, I think it was a swamp of, it was one of the swamp for that. Yeah. 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 He had the little fez on his head. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> and he would, he, he'd throw poop at people. It was beautiful. But, you know, that is, <laughs> I'm not neither confirming nor denying that I played World of Warcraft. It was a good time. I played on an emu server for a while. It was fun. A little cartoony, but it wasn't bad. It just wasn't yeah. EQ. My niece, yeah. please. Yeah, our niece is a is a is a guild leader in a some hardcore raiding guild. <laughs> yeah. One thing from WoW that I wish Scar would implement here somehow is early on the warlocks had this uh, thing that they would summon that everyone could click on and, and channel like like five people could do it at the same time. And you'd all sit there, and it would it would take a couple of seconds, and then one of them would just die. One of you just dead. So it's like a, it was like a suicide, uh, um, Russian roulette or something. Okay. <laughs> it was the the little ritual stone that summoned the demon that, that you had to actually charm. It wasn't a pet, right off. Yeah, I remember that. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. We also would do that right before Battlegrounds, and that was a lot of fun. 